Okay, so you probably already heard the news. Unity has changed its pricing plan. How is it working? Should you worry about it? And what does it imply for us VR developers? One thing is sure, the whole game dev ecosystem is on fire and if you are confused about the whole situation, let me sum up for you. Okay, so here is the graphic Unity has shared to explain their new fee and while it does not cover every little details, we can understand that if you use Unity for free and that you publish a game, if the games you publish makes more than $200,000 of gross revenue and more than 200,000 install on every new install that you will make after this threshold, you will be charged 20 cents. For example, if I sell a game $10 and if it's installed 300,000 times, I am above the threshold with a total revenue of 3 million and more than 200,000 install and I will have to pay 20 cents for the 100,000 install above that threshold, so $20,000. Now, if you decided not to go with Unity Personal, which is free, and take Unity Pro, which is like $2,000 per year per seed, you can get a discount on the install fee. But here is what is important. Having to pay Unity something is not why game developers are angry right now. According to them, this change is targeted to a small percent of its users. And if we do the bad with another game engine like Unreal, Unity is in most cases cheaper. So if this is not the main reason why this huge mess, let me explain. Having to pay per install and not per revenue like Unreal Engine does is not only more complicated but can create some huge unity cut in some cases. Take for example the successful mobile game studio, which will have to pay to Unity even more than what they earn. And the reason is because their game is free and that the revenue they make is from in-app purchases. They don't get money from somebody installing their game, but will still have to pay to Unity the 20 cent fee. Now let's have a look at another concern. What exactly count as an install? Is a pirated game an install? Is an update an install? What about game on the web? What about demo? And what if someone uninstall and reinstall the same game? In their latest statement, Unity has reassured us that they will only count the new install once and will do so using their own runtime count and anti-fraud system. In other words, we will have to rely on trusting Unity on these numbers and this transition us to our next concern. Unity relationship with its user was already in bad shape with some questionable acquisition and the reputation of its CEO. So having to rely on Unity for what you pay is something that a lot of people does not feel comfortable with. Not only this, but with the new pricing plan, Unity shows that they can change their term of services at any point which makes some developers concerned to see worse change happening later on or even an increase on the runtime fee. Now, this channel focuses on VR development, so let's just talk about the implication on the VR industry. Without a doubt, Unity is the most popular game engine for VR. 60% of VR games are made with Unity, and this number is not expected to decrease with the latest partnership between Apple and Unity for their new announced VR headsets. Many successful VR games like Gorilla Attack, VR Chat, or Rec Room are free and made with Unity, which means that they will see a huge spike on their Unity fee, and this will certainly discourage some studios of making their own VR game free. Not only VR games are impacted, but the store as well. SideQuest has made an official statement to threaten legal unity and to say that on their VR store, there is no install, these are just clicks. So at this point, this is everything that we know. Of course, we should expect more use from Unity very soon. On a personal note, I really hope this situation gets better. I am not afraid to say that I love Unity. This software changed my life for the better and it's really hard to see this change happening. Thanks for watching and let's hope we can just go back to making cool stuff and not have to worry about this anymore.